Minister of Interior S.A.R. Keng, human trafficking is a new kind of slavery. Minister Keng condemned human trafficking and called it a brutal act and a new slavery that can lead to the suffering of people. Forest chief takes actions against illegal loggers and encroachers. Legal measures will be taken against those who illegally logged and encroached on the community forest in one of Stung Treng's districts stated the forest chief. Laos praises Cambodia's rapid development amid pandemic. Lao People's Democratic Republic, appreciated and highly valued Cambodia's rapid development despite the COVID-19 pandemic. Second COVID death-free day for Cambodia as only four new cases recorded. Cambodia recorded its second COVID death-free day in a row as daily new cases remain at remarkably low levels, continuing a 82-day unbroken run of new normal ultra-low figures. Capital administration to build new flyover as traffic congestion worsens. With the increase of daily traffic congestion increasing, the capital administration announced that a plan for a new flyover is in the works to facilitate the travel and cut down of time spent in traveling of the residents of Phnom Penh. WHO issues warning on rapid transmission of Omicron as variant starts establishing foothold in other countries. Just days after Cambodia announced its fourth Omicron variant, the World Health Organization, WHO, has issued another warning on the heightened transmissibility of the new variant with more Asian countries announcing the emergence of more cases. WHO calls for international unity to end pandemic by 2022. The World Health Organization's WHO, Director General, Dr. Tedros Adhanom Ghebreyesus, has called for countries to work together to end the pandemic by 2022. Over 114,100 candidates to take 2021's upper secondary school exam. Some 114,180 students across Cambodia have registered for the upcoming upper secondary school exams to happen on December 27 to December 28. Visit of Vietnamese President to bolster bilateral cooperation. The state visit of the President of the Socialist Republic of Vietnam, Nguyen Suan Phuc, to Cambodia will further strengthen and deepen bilateral relations under the spirit of good neighborliness, traditional friendship, comprehensive cooperation, and long-lasting peace and stability between the two countries for the mutual benefits of the two peoples. Environmental and crane conservation subjects included in curriculum of three Tokeo primary schools. Three primary schools in Tokeo have included environmental studies and the study of crane conservation into their curriculums, highlighting a commitment to educating students of the importance of environmental protection.